Hello, everybody. That was kind of a screwed up intro. Hello, everybody. Welcome to NFL Picks. I'm Drunk Farmer. And I just want to say this. Now, we all know that Kansas City and Buffalo last Sunday went into overtime. And Kansas City won the game on an overtime touchdown. Buffalo just sat there and watched. That's all they could have done. Josh Allen and the Buffalo football team just sat there and watched Kansas City drive down the field, score a touchdown, end a game. And I thought to myself, well, that was kind of disappointing, which I think it was. I kind of thought, I, I thought it was. I thought it was kind of disappointing. I mean, after that crazy fourth quarter, then you go into overtime, Kansas City scores, scores a touchdown, and you're like, that's it? It's over? Now, how this all came about was a friend of mine sent me uh, something on Instant Messenger, and we kind of talked about it. And he said, I don't know why the NFL won't change the rules for overtime in the playoffs. And I thought to myself, eh, maybe he's on to something. He was. So I got to thinking about it, and so... I thought about it, and I said, God, he is on to something. So anyway, the deal is, I think they should tweak the rules for overtime for the playoffs. And the reason why, because it'd probably make the football game and to the NFL football fan more exciting, more interesting. This is how they should do it. I'm going to go back to the old days, okay? First of all, back in the day, each team would have a chance to score. If one team scores a touchdown or a field goal, the other team would have a chance to score. Okay? If it was a touchdown, the other team would still have a chance to score a tying touchdown or try to win it with a two-point conversion. There you go. That's how they did it in the old days. That's Now, the overtime that we have now, oh, let me refresh your memory on the rules, if a football team goes down and scores a field goal, that will give the other team a chance to go down and try to win the game with a touchdown. But if the team wins the toss in overtime and go and drives down the field and scores a touchdown, the only thing the other team could do is sit there and watch, right? Right. That's kind of like takes the thrill out of the game. And it kind of took the thrill out of the Buffalo Kansas City game because it was like, really? It's over? So then I liked I liked I liked the old rules better because it, at least if they tweak the rules and I wish the NFL rule committee would look at this if they would tweak the rules a little bit and let each team have a chance let's okay for example if a team goes down and scores a touchdown let's give the that other team a chance to either go down you know go down and score a touchdown and or tie the game and keep going until we have a winner, or they can try a two-point version and win the game. But if they fail to do it, if the other team fails to do, you know, score a touchdown or a field goal or whatever, they can lose the game on a fourth down conversion play or a turnover. Now that'd be the game. That's it. They had their chance. They're done. But at least it's giving. A, the other team a chance to score. It's a 50-50 shot, and I think the NFL Rules Committee should look at that. It'd make the football game more interesting. To a fan, it'd make it more exciting. It'd keep the drama going. Not like Buffalo and Kansas City, which is like, yeah, you know, like I said, it was kind of like, it's over. Kansas City fans, they were happy. Buffalo fans, I'm sure they had a few choice words. But what I'm getting at, make the game more interesting. Make it more exciting. At least it's the playoffs for the love of God. Let's let the other team have a chance, you know, to at least try to score. And I wish the NFL, like I said, I wish the NFL Rules Committee would look at that. I don't know. I don't know if I'm the only one that feels this way. I'm sure I'm not. I'm sure a lot of Buffalo fans <laughs> kind of feel the same way. They say, well, they should have let 
at least give us a chance. I would like to see the rules tweaked in the playoffs. I mean, the regular season, I can care less about. I mean, the regular season is the regular season. If they tie, they tie. But I'd like to see a more extended overtime in the playoffs. I mean, like I said, bottom line, at least give the other team a chance to score, you know, to make things more interesting. If they score, great. They can go for a two-point conversion to win the game, or they can tie it. I mean, let's face it, it's not automatic uh, extra points anymore. They're 37 yards out. So let's consider that also. On that note, how many of you would like to see the playoff, the overtime, the overtime rules tweaked a little bit for the playoffs? If you do, yay or nay, you know, yes or no. Put it in the comment box below or tell me how you feel about it. Also, you can also hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up button. And I will see you this Sunday. Probably I'll see you next week. And I'll give you my predictions on the Super Bowl. What two teams are going to be in it. I don't know yet. But I'll give you my prediction. And I'll, and I'll review the games too. The last two games. The last two playoff games until the Super Bowl. And I'll kind of review them. So until then, everyone, that's kind of a crappy ending, but it's late at night. So, like I said, until then, I am Drunk Farmer. This has been NFL Picks, and I just wanted to vent a little bit about that. So long, everyone. I'm out of here. Bye.